Subscribe to Bootstrap Session if you haven't. Today we are going to fix this VirtualBox error. Kernel driver not installed RC1908 in Mac. It works for all of the Mac products where you can install the VirtualBox. All right. And it has been tested by this person, Editoy50 at the rate YouTube. Here's his YouTube channel. You can see this person, very great person. All right. So first of all, you need to download the latest VirtualBox installer so click on this link from here now here you have to just click on the second option osx hosts and it will download the latest virtual box file the dmg file all right now after downloading the latest installer you have to uninstall virtual box all right so for uninstalling virtual box in the finder menu you need to go to the applications here all right and if you don't find applications here go to the desktop click on finder go to preferences click on sidebar and enable applications here all right and you can see the applications menu here okay now click on applications open it a new tab and here scroll to the last you will see virtual box here all right right click on it click on move to bin now you have to type your user password for doing that press enter now it has been uninstalled all right now just right click on the bin and click on empty bin click on empty and here you can see that it's empty all right now after uninstalling virtual box you need to reboot your mac go to the apple logo click on restart all right so now after restarting your mac you have to uninstall the latest downloaded virtual box that's here i have just copied it here just double click on it now you have to double click on this virtualbox.pkg file click on continue click on continue install enter your user password here press enter now it will install the virtual box here and as soon as it install you will see this oracle america dot inc developer option in your security and privacy of your mac settings so you just have to open up the Mac settings go to the Apple logo click on system preferences and here you have to just go to this security and privacy and you will see that option right here all right so the installation was successful click on close you can see that I am not getting this option this one it is because I have already allowed it earlier okay you will definitely get this option and you have to click on this allow button here right here okay but for allowing that you just have to unlock this button so type your user password here press enter now it will unlock and you can just change the settings here and you need to make sure that the second option is ticked all right and now after clicking on allow you just have to lock it back and the changes will be saved now after that option just close it and launch the virtual box okay this one in the finder and let me show you by running one of the distributions here this option is just for the accessibility features like clipboard copying feature so click on open system preferences and here you have to give access to this virtual box app all right so unlock it first type your user password now tick mark this option virtual box and lock it back and it has been granted accessibility service also all right so we have fixed both of the problems this one kernel driver not installed and the accessibility service also and you can see that this option is available only for 30 minutes after the virtual boss installation so you need to make sure that you open up the security and privacy settings as soon as you install the virtual box all right otherwise you have to just follow the procedure from 0 to 4 okay so please subscribe to boost up session and that's it for now thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more